Now, Britain's next generation of scientists got their hands on the wonder material of the future this morning when they were invited to have a go at making graphene. It was discovered in Manchester and it is so strong that a sheet of it, as thin as cling film, could support the weight of an elephant. Our environment correspondent Colin Sykes reports. A science taste today at the University of Manchester. It said these pupils will be children of the graphene age. But what is it? So we're going to start from pencil lead and we're going to make the thinnest material in the world, essentially. This is how scientists at the university discovered the material, by separating graphite particles to produce a thin sheet of incredibly strong carbon atoms. Each carbon atom here is the black dot, and then they're connected by these bonds and they're arranged in a hexagonal manner. The excitement about graphene is its commercial potential. If you take something like the mobile phone, by using graphene in its manufacture, you could end up with a phone that was half the thickness of this and bendable as well. Experts say graphene could replace silicon as the raw material in computer chips. Any field that you take graphene to, it seems to be doing better than what is already there. So potentially it could have an impact on a large number of fields that touch our lives in a large number of areas. The government has pledged £38 million to the university to develop graphene. These children are likely to see it in numerous products of the future. Colin Sykes, BBC Northwest Today, Manchester.